Prince Edward's son James won't inherit dad's title, it could go to Princess Charlotte. It has been stated that James, the teenage son of Prince Edward, is not expected to inherit his father's current title of Duke of Edinburgh. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. When Edward succeeded his father as Duke of Edinburgh in March 2023, the 16-year-old monarch was given the title Earl of Wessex. James became the Earl of Wessex after Prince Edward, who turned 59 in March of last year, was given the title of Duke of Edinburgh, which had belonged to his late father, Prince Philip. Since his birth in 2007, James had been referred to as Viscount Seven. Lady Louise Windsor, his elder sister, retained her title unaltered despite his own title change from the previous year. When Buckingham Palace announced that Edward would become the Duke of Edinburgh, they made it clear that Prince Edward will hold the title for His Royal Highness's lifetime. After his own passing, the title will return to the crown, and the occupying monarch will select the next in line for the title. Since James isn't expected to receive the title of Edinburgh, Princess Charlotte is a possibility. Prince William's only daughter, Princess Charlotte, aged eight, is third in line for the throne at the moment. The condition that the title of Edinburgh will return to the crown, is in line with King Charles's apparent desire for a more limited monarchy. Edward and his spouse, Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, decided not to give their children the customary titles of prince and princess after their births in 2003 and 2007. Their children, Lady Louise, 20, and James, are now adults. The 59-year-old Sophie previously gave an explanation of their desire in a Times of London interview. We try to bring them up with the understanding they are very likely to have to work for a living, the mother of two stated to the publication. This is the reason we decided against using HRH titles. They have them and can decide to use them from, the age of, 18, but I think it's highly unlikely. As previously revealed by the Times, the late Prince Philip had wanted his youngest son to become the Duke of Edinburgh. The article went on to say that Buckingham Palace had even made it clear that Edward and Sophie were the intended recipients of the designation on their wedding day in 1999. At that time, the palace issued a statement that read, the Queen, the Duke of Edinburgh and the Prince of Wales have also agreed that Prince Edward should be given the Dukedom of Edinburgh in due course, when the present title held now by Prince Philip eventually reverts to the crown. A royal analyst, has stated that Prince Edward's offspring might introduce a burst of youth into King Charles's redesigned monarchy. If they accept royal responsibilities and provide an injection of youth, the royal expert thinks James Earl of Wessex, 16, and Lady Louise Windsor, 20, could play significant roles in the monarchy in the future. Royal commentator Richard Eden described how Prince Edward and Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, embodied the greatest qualities of Edward's late parents, Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip, in a piece that appeared in the Daily Mail's Palace Confidential newsletter. I think the couple could also do a great deal for the country by encouraging their children, Lady Louise and James, the Earl of Wessex, to become working royals when the time is appropriate, he stated. The expert went on to say, when Prince William becomes king, I hope that he will follow the example of his grandmother, Queen Elizabeth, and ask his cousins, including Louise and James, to share royal duties with him. James, the youngest child of the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh, accompanied his parents to Windsor this past weekend for the Easter Sunday service. But Lady Louise's studies prevented her from attending. The twenty-year-old princess, like her cousin, is presently enrolled in her second year of English literature at the University of St Andrews in Scotland, the same institution where the heir apparent enrolled and first met Princess Kate. 